Hey everybody, I haven't done a video in a minute. There's Ida May and there is Mr. Riley, huh? Hello, Riley. And um, I bet y'all always wonder, why in the hell's he hiding behind that? He's always got something up there. I bet y'all wonder. I bet you're confused. And you're thinking, eh, this guy's got a big old, big old mess. Probably got a huge mess back there. I mean, huge. Um, right now, we are anchoring some things down, and uh, that light makes some goofy reaction there. Um, we are anchoring some things down, and I'm going to be showing you these scans tools. You're going to freaking love these. I am a, I'm a new believer, so stay tuned. I'm going to do a video on those. And we're going to be running this up pretty quick and that inverter on these new batteries. Now, you see how big those are? And you see that little bitty thing? Look at this little bitty thing. Look at this little bitty thing. That's what Karna credit will do for you. It, I had to use the, you know, pay monthly thing. But my wife got that. That is her gift to herself. And my uh, neighbor got that because of he got one of those. He came over. He used it for three days. And he's like, oh, God, I love that thing. So he bought this. And we're going to open this up. He wants me to open it up. He said, go ahead. And there is this. So you guys want to see what I'm dealing with in the shop. Maybe that's a good thing to start with. And what in the heck am we? Why is he? What's he hiding? What is he hiding? Well, let's just, let's walk around. What the hell, right? Okay. Hi. What's he hiding, right? She's turned my shop into a knit shop knitting needles and stitch markers everywhere this is what kira does in my shop it's this my is newest what newest design this is what she does on a regular basis every day what do you do knit knit mm -hmm. how old are you i'm 17 17 years old all freaking day all day I got all kinds of things I want to show you guys. Conversions, you name it. Built-in micro inverter in that. Yeah. And then I want to show you this. This is a little tour of the shop. We're just going to give you all a little tour. Calm down. This has never been. Look at this beautiful thing. Oh, I know. Man, I had one of them Grand Prix when I was a kid. had flashy lights and it didn't work right and it got them scratchy and all. Come on, man. I give eight bucks for that. It's brand new. This box was sealed when I got it. I've carried this thing for about seven years. That's why the box is tattered. So all kinds of things, such as what you can use these for. We're going to get into all that. And numerous things, including wind turbine automatic braking. Kara's project. Kara? Yeah? Whose project? Mine. Speak up. It's mine. Her project. So she's building... Scooter. She's making so they have two of these, two of these, um, two of these Eco Smarts. Eco is that what they are? Yeah, Eco Smart Metros, little 500 watt motors on them. And we may be building them into a car. I got to figure out how to make an independent suspension in the rear, but dual motor and using a single 10 volt actuator with a splitter and diodes. I might be able to build a 46 amp. 36 volt and that's what she's working on there's her little welder and this is what she uses to charge her welder huh yeah my thing my favorite thing this this thing here still at 100 percent. she must have charged that up all right so let's take a little tour in the shop we have screwdrivers screwdrivers nut drivers pma parts that's permanent magnet alternator parts we have a lot of these are mislabeled now but you name it all the different test gear and test equipment and everything you could possibly imagine for working on stuff. I can't hardly pull this out. Here, you blocked everything. Sorry. And, um, you know, capacitors, uh, you know, little instant solder and irons and you name it. And miscellaneous stuff everywhere. Charge controllers, a whole bunch of charge controllers in there for little jobs. Um, thermal controllers all kinds of thermal controllers i mean this is stuff that a lot of people don't even know what the hell these are so this is like a really really cool hydraulic action switch 
unbelievable how accurate they are and they're only about eight bucks so we use them in everything this is a whole lot of bimetal switches you see that bimetal switches and uh bimetal means two different types of metal with reactive temperature same with all of these um 12 volt controllers and remotes and timers and you name it lugs lots of lugs lots of resistors tons of ohmites and you name it for uh wind turbines let's see here um uh, you name it <laughs> uh controller boxes for wind turbine controllers this is for the basic and this is for the advanced and somewhere around here i have a whole bunch of those too uh lots of meters different meters of every kind amp meters digital meters volt meters shunts uh, these really unique things now these i use for automatic wind turbine braking systems this is a dvm at 12 volt but you can also get a 24 or 36 or 48 all that you can get them all um let's see looking through here um i've got a box that's probably nothing but controllers no nope, this is like yeah this is all you know motion sensor daylight to dark both infrared and daylight to dark these light you're going to see these lights when you see these lights god if your camera can do it justice um shrink tape 12 volt lighting all these little things these are like I don't know, $15, you get like 25 of these, and they're perfect for 12 volt, just all DC bolt lighting, 24 volt, you name it. Um, fuses, just a couple of them, a few hundred, thousand. And um, these, a lot of people are like, where do you get them? These are for wind turbines. This is I can do my braking and my resistor loading for wind turbines. Um, solar connectors. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Lots of them. And... Uh, I think somewhere in here I do have a huge box, here we go, here we go, of OPC controllers. So there's an OPC controller, there's an OPC controller, here's a mod, uh, let's see here, there's basics, these are the basics in here, um, this is a, a last generation, these right here are voltage, um, undervolt relays, um, what we got here, all little screws for them, more, oof, more OPC controllers and uh i shouldn't like rather plastic this is the the advanced basic um just a whole drawer full i gotta fix that in a little bit whole drawer full of these ssrs uh now you always want to make sure your ssrs are dc to dc when you get those so using that for heat sinks instead of paying eight dollars for the little ones those that right there is only about 30 cents and they work great as long as you put the right ssr on it um so yeah this is a little walkthrough and you'll see it's a parts bin from hell and of course this is for well that's gun stuff so same thing uh, so pretty much all that and then that's the curious little shooting stuff there but you look through here and you see everything i mean zip ties look at this a couple of fans these go in the uh the boxes that are made to keep the rectifiers cool got a few just a few just a few and this is audio repair parts, a lot of fan blowers, tw uh, 120 volt Peltier cooler units, and just a lot. Um, so over here, it's just a cluster. Um, here is something really unique. This has never been opened. PC88 complete audio box. The tape is just, look, factory tape is still coming. It's coming off of it, but complete factory, complete factory, everything with it. And, um, haven't done anything with that just a mess spools and spools of wire and other stuff in here lots of manuals and look at this stuff just you name it walk through the shop plumbing crap um oh, you ain't gonna believe how many i got like a hundred of these this is just packed um welders spot welders hydraulic bit hydraulic kit um toolboxes 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 electronics kira hello kira Kira and um, just tons. Whoo, parts falling out. Um, tons of stuff. Tons of stuff. I got a real, real nice laser. We're going to be doing a, a video on that later because I'm doing a well pump house. Different type of kits that she builds. These are hers. The Kira builds these things. She buys a lot of them. Look at this one. I don't. I don't even know what half of them are. So her money. She, there's another one. So 
resistors, capacitors, diodes, transistors, you, you freaking name it. You freaking name it. Tools. So that's another one. Resistors. This is the stuff that goes on in the background. So you want to know that's sitting there. What in the hell's going on in the background? There's toolboxes and toolboxes. And once again, there's 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 Kira knitting my shop. So sometimes you guys don't realize when I do a video, this is going to get open soon, real quick, probably in the next day or two. Uh, when I do a video and you see this in the background and you wonder what's back there, that's a common feature right there. Ha! Huh. It's a multi-purpose building. Multi-purpose building. How sweet. So if you have any clue of what that looks like to live with, and that too. Um, it's right over here. It's, a, <laughs> it's where? Here. It's right over there, Mrs. Nitwit. I'm sunshine. Hers, she's the sunshine. Isn't that wonderful? So big inverters up there, big stereos, big speakers. This is just, the, the shop is still in a... a work process but this is my daily grind and that is what's behind the screen the backdrop and other than riley being on the floor oh other things other things <laughs> so you see that kira sandwich making stuff she pretty much lives in my shop so uh we got a lock on it because i got a granddaughter that has a problem with sodas and um she don't know any better but there you go there little generator and we're going to get into this i want to show you this real quick real quick it's going to be in a real quick video but this is the new light li time it used to be amper time but i want to show you something 100 amp 100 amp hour i can almost put four and an eighth of these inside of that normal 8d case yeah that freaky them compact as hell beautiful they finally did it so we're going to get in depth on that i mean look at this versus a normal case size look at that it's about a quarter inch taller see um or half inch maybe a half inch taller but everything else it's really small probably about six of these in the space of three of those or four of those a lot better outcome a lot better outcome all right and then you can look at a little 30 amper there. All right, so that's been a little tour. And look what I use here for powering my, my lights right here. Um, that's been a little tour of what we got going on. And we're going to run that, that uh, inverter at 2,000 watt and that 3,000 watt over there on some of these batteries. And we're going we're gonna to check them out. We're, we're not nice. If it don't work good, it don't work good. But it's the truth. If you don't like it, you don't got to be nice to it. Those right there, I'm paying $63 a month for, for a year. But those right there are going in a well house, and that's because they do everything. So mowers coming up, 80-volt electric versus my wife's choice. I tried to go there with her, but she wanted that. And look, I want to show you this real quick, real quick. You see that? Horizontal engine, transfer drive. What the hell? Right, 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 right. Right, Kira? Yeah. Yeah. All right, guys. What, Kira? I see y'all be good. Bye. Isn't that something? I think she's right. Y'all be good.